diagnostic checking that we shall do now diagnostic checking okay that we shall do now okay okay that means uh, what is desirable this model should not have any serial correlation this model should not have any arch effect and and the residuals of this touch model should be normally distributed so that is desirable okay first i check whether this touch model has any serial correlation or not i go to view residual diagnostic then i check coral gram squared residuals right i check this one and i choose 36 lakhs no problem press ok ok and you can see the q statistics right you can see 36 lakh and you can see corresponding probability value right probability value you can see it right and and what is our null hypothesis the null hypothesis is there is no serial correlation and that is the null hypothesis and and that is desirable and here you can see our p value are more than 5% meaning that we cannot reject null hypothesis rather we accept null hypothesis meaning that this model has no serial correlation so we are happy about this model because there is no serial correlations okay the second one that this model has no arch effect that we want to check I go to view residual diagnostic arch effect I click here and it is the arch test right arch test so and okay so it is the arch result right arch result observed r square p value corresponding p value and what is our null hypothesis the null is there is no arch effect that is the null and what is our p value the p value is 82.64 percent which is more than 5 percent meaning that we cannot reject null hypothesis meaning that we accept null hypothesis meaning that our our model our touch model do not have any any arch arch effect so we are happy about this model because there is no arch effect and touch effect and finally finally we check whether the whether the residual is normally distributed or not so I choose uh, this one uh, the test of normality I click it okay and you can see the Jarkabera statistics and corresponding p-value right Jarkabera and corresponding p-value what is the null hypothesis the null is the residuals are normally distributed and what is alternative residuals are not normally distributed so here the p-value is very small less than 5 percent meaning that we can reject null hypothesis and can accept alternative meaning that residuals are not normally distributed so that is not a good sight right residuals are not normally distributed so that is not good sight but still we accept the model why because many say that many argue that although many argue that although the residuals are not normal but still we can accept the model and for this model we are happy because there is no serial correlation 
but there is no arch effect. But although the residuals are not normal, but many argue that still we can accept the model. Okay, finally, what I want to say, to say, want to say, we have used the variable BSR, right? That is Bangladesh stock return, Bangladesh stock return. But make sure our variable must be stationary in nature. Only then I can run it, I can use it to estimate torch model. And here I have assumed that our BSR is does not have any unit root, meaning that our BSR variable is a stationary variable that I assume without testing, right? and then only I can run the model and I assume that it is it is a stationary variable so I use this variable to estimate arch garch torch model thank you very much for being with me okay one more thing if the va variable is not stationary or if the variable has unit root then you have to convert the variable into stationary after that you can run the model not before that because the variable must be stationary thank you for being with me for a while